Welcome to q and &E Software, Cloud Accounting Software for E-Commerce Transformation. Keep the strength of offline, bring your business online. In this video, I will introduce Billing Approval Module. Billing Approval Module allows higher level users to approve or reject bills created by user. The main advantage of using this process is to avoid billing process generated without management concern thus saving time when moving data through the organization. To enable this module, go to File, Modules. Click on Billing Approvals Control. To create user roles, go to Maintenance, User Roles. Key in a role name and description, and then assign its access right. To create user account, go to Maintenance, Users. Key in the username and full name. For notification purposes, ensure that user's email is set up correctly here. Next, assign the user roles for this user. Go to Billing Approval, Billing Approvals. Click on the new button to create a new approval level. Define the table. Approval level. User role. Maximum amount limit. and assign the users accordingly. Repeat these steps to create level 2 and level 3 users. Now, let's issue a sales order. Click on the Approval tab and select the user that you wish to seek approval from. Click on the Save button. 
proceed to click on the yes button and system will send a notification to the higher level user. Higher level user will receive the notification in their email account, informing them that there is a document pending for their approval. When the higher level user log into the system, a reminder will appear on the bottom right. Click on the reminder to go to Pending Approvals Inquiry screen. Click on the Approval tab and the user has the option to either approve or reject the document and state the rejected reason. Once again, after the document is saved, a notification will be sent out to notify the creator whether the document is approved or rejected. To better understand how billing approval module works, I will show you two different scenarios. In the first scenario, Staff A issue a sales order with a total amount of 3,800. In order to transfer this sales order to delivery order, Staff A is required to seek approval from level 1 users only. Please take note that level 2 and level 3 users are not required to approve this sales order as the amount is less than 5000. In the second scenario, staff B issue a sales order with a total amount of 8000. In order to transfer this sales order to delivery order, Staff B is required to seek approval from Level 1 and Level 2 users. Please take note that both Level 1 and Level 2 users must approve this sales order in order for this sales order to be transferred to delivery order or sales invoice. Thank you for watching.